Well, the 2023 NFL Draft is officially underway, and the Atlanta Falcons already have their first round draft pick. I'm actually here with him right now, the eighth overall pick in the 2023 draft, B. John Robinson from the University of Texas. How are we yep. feeling in this moment right now? Oh, my gosh. I mean, it's just, like, such a blessing. Um, just know that God blessed me to be here at the Falcons. Like, I'm so excited. I mean, I'm kind of speechless. Like, it's just it's crazy. It's crazy. But, you know, I'm really happy um, even to be here with my family just to celebrate it uh, and just to just to enjoy this time, you know? Yeah. You talk, You spoke about your family a little bit. Talk to me about – we heard some screams in the back when you got the phone call. How excited was yeah. all of your family at when you got the call? Yeah, I mean, they were, they were obviously – they were so excited. Um, you know, we've – We've been working for this for, for such a long time. It's been such a dream of mine um, just to make it to the, to, to the NFL. Uh, but, I mean, even even just seeing their reaction and seeing how just happy they were, and you know, it, it just made me just so just so happy. I almost want, I just want to cry, like, because, I mean, it's just, like, such an amazing moment, um, especially, like, you know, for me, for me and my family. Yeah, it's been a long journey for you. I mean, when the offseason starts, you have the combine, you have meetings, you have interviews, you have – Pro day. Yeah. What was kind of your favorite part leading up to the draft? I think uh, probably probably the combine. Um, you know, I, I had a really good time at the combine, and just meeting you know so many so many guys and making so many relationships. Um, even meeting all the players that I've grown up with uh, since high school and obviously college. Um, but I think that it was just a really fun experience, and then even like going on the field and just doing some football stuff, doing some football drills. Uh, it, it was it was really fun for me, uh, but I mean for the whole process though, like you know, I only I only got the process one time, so I was just trying to enjoy it as much as I can, um, and just you know smile all the time. I mean I smiled ninety percent of my life, so like I was out there just cheesing and and just enjoying myself and having a good time. I mean, it was probably a fun time all around, but it can't be as fun as the actual NFL draft. Let's actually talk about that for just a second. When you saw yep. the Atlanta area code pop up on your phone, what were you feeling? I mean, my heart just like stopped for a second. I was like, "Whoa!" I was like, "This is this is crazy." Um, and when I answered the phone, I mean, it was like immediate excitement from from you know the the GM, coaches, uh, the owner. I mean, myself, all the family. Um, and I was trying to like hear them, so I was trying to like duck down to hear, uh, just because everybody was so excited. But when when I mean, you got that call, I mean, it's it's a moment that, that you'll never forget. And obviously, you know, God bless me to be here. So it, it's, it's so amazing. I know you said it was a little bit hard to hear when you got the phone call. But when you got the call from Terry Fontenot and head coach Arthur Smith, what did they say to you on the call? Yeah, I mean, they're just like, man, I mean, you, you just fit, fit what, we, what we believe here when, when it comes to personality. Uh, obviously, the play on the field and, you know, just what they're trying to do with, with me and my, my, my skill set. Um, and they were just like, man, I, it's time. It's time to go. It's time to get ready. Uh, it's gonna be. It's gonna be a fun ride. And you know, just hearing that from them, and, and for me, you know, and that, how that builds my confidence, you know, they, off the bat, um, it was. It was just really cool to to, to know that they accept me um, and, and bring me into the team. You can play a lot of different roles. You kind of said that, and they told you that on the phone. You can play a lot of different roles on the offense. What can you tell the fans that you're gonna be able to bring to the forefront in Atlanta? Yeah, well, you know, obviously, you know, I want to I want to bring so much just positivity, obviously, the, the, the you know, me playing on the field and, you know, bringing that skill set. Um, but I want to you know go in the communities, you know, do awesome things in the community. Obviously, I'm the, you know, be, be the best player I can be for the, for the whole team, for the whole city, for the whole program. Um, but but I, you know, I just can't wait to see what God does for, for you know, the team and I, because uh, this is just such a big moment for all of us. You're going to be playing with a younger offense with guys like Tyler Algier, Drake London, Kyle Pitts, Desmond Ritter. I mean, like the list kind of goes on. What are you most excited about for like with playing with these guys? What's most exciting for you? Yeah, I mean, well, you just said it. Like, you know, it's a, it's a young offense with, with so much great talent. And I think that, you know, when you got young guys that can, you know, contribute as much as they can and, you know, try to build something really, really special, um, then, then that's, where you, that's where you start off with because – you know, when you just said, young guys, we can, we can do this for such a long time I and mean, be so effective for such a long time in the, in the NFL while we're here. Um, and we're, we're all going to obviously, you know, do our jobs uh, the right way and, and do it really fun. Um, but I'm happy, to, I'm happy to be with those guys and, and just enjoy it with them. 
you, I mean, a lot of people know what you can do on the football field. And they know a lot about you on the football field. So let's kind of flip the script a little bit. What's one thing that Falcons fans might not know about B. John Robinson? Yeah. Um, well, I, like, love, like, love to be with kids um, and, like, just have fun with kids. Uh, obviously, like, I love to do, like, camps and, you know, just be around, be a part um, of, of those type of things just because, you know, I'm such a guy that, that will bring so much positivity to anything and just put smiles on people's faces is, is such a cool thing for me. Um, and then maybe one day, like, I always say, like, I want to be an actor uh, one day. So even, even just bringing people into that as well. Um, but obviously that's, that's down the line here. Uh, but that, that's something that people probably don't know about me. Yeah, an actor. Maybe we can get him on camera a couple of times while he's in Atlanta. I know you're in Kansas City right now, but you're going to be in Flowery yeah. Branch really soon. We're so excited to have you on the team. Bijan, thank you for taking the time. Welcome to Atlanta. Absolutely. Yeah, thanks for having me. You know, I can't wait. Yeah. Hey.